Well, it really doesn't get any better than this. Being invited to Monte Carlo to test drive, well, not only the sunshine and the beautiful hotels here, the all-new Audi A3 Cabriolet. The A3 sedan will be arriving in Canada in the spring of 2014 with this A3 Cabriolet coming in the fall. Both are built off a shared platform with Volkswagen called MQB. This platform is a significant investment for the Volkswagen Group as it's lighter, bigger and stronger than the last Golf A3 platform provides a sturdy basis for this new A3 Cabrio. The A3 Cabrio comes standard with the 2-liter direct injection 4-cylinder with 220 horsepower. Standard equipment also is Quattro and the S-Tronic dual clutch. There is no manual and no diesel offered in the A3 cab. The A3 Cabriolet compared to the sedan or the S3 is a more sophisticated approach thanks to the use of aluminum around the front windshield and the trim along the doors and rear quarter panels that make the car look bigger than it really is. Audi claims that this new five-layer convertible roof is one of the quietest on the market because of a special layer of sound insulation. Plus, the roof can be raised or lowered while the car is driving at speeds of up to 50 kilometers an hour, and it does it in 19 seconds. The price for the A3 cab has not been confirmed yet, but expect to pay in the low to mid $40,000 range for this car. So the inside of the Audi A3 is very nicely finished and quite different than the Mercedes CLA that it's competing against. It doesn't seem as busy, very clean lines, wonderful materials on the side, on the door, on the dash, and very clean looking. In the center you have Audi's MMI system, which I really do enjoy using, very simple. There's a pop-up screen on the dash here, which is different than some of the other products we're seeing lately that has that screen center in the dash, but it's permanent. It doesn't hide away. I like the fact that it can hide away and it's very clean. Not sure yet with this Cabriolet whether the MMI system is going to be standard equipment in Canada, but it will be a part of a package. If you want to get it, you can definitely get that in the A3 Cabriolet. They say there's room for four adults in this vehicle. I would say definitely two adults in the front seat. The back seat is best for kids, especially if you slide the seats forward. Driving this drop top on the edge of the Mediterranean with the warm sun beaming in made me really want to sell my house and move to this principality and live the dream. But it's just that, a dream only for the mega rich that can live in this area. The good news is you don't have to be rich to enjoy this fantastic convertible. The platform is very rigid, the suspension is perfect for cruising, but it's also dialed in for any corners you encounter, and the new 2-liter direct injection engine is a beauty. Not wanting to get into the horsepower race with their competition, Audi feel that this much power, 220 horsepower, with very good low-end torque is a good balance of enthusiasm, efficiency, and also controlling emissions. The closest competitor would be the very dated 1 Series from BMW. So look for this fresh modern A3 cab coming in the fall of 2014. So to recap, the Audi A3 Cabriolet is going to be sold basically in one configuration. It's got the 2 liter direct injection gasoline engine. We only get the uh, S-Tronic dual clutch automatic transmission in Canada. We don't get the manual. We've had a chance to drive the manual here and it's a shame because it really is wonderful. The trunk is a pretty good size. It splits and folds down so you can get longer items in there. This model has not been sold in Canada in the past. The previous European model is um, it's been around for a while and this car is 60 kilograms lighter than the previous model. It's exciting to get finally a wider range of vehicles in the A3 line in Canada. This particular model, no pricing yet, but it will be available for sale in the fall of 2014.